Thanks for joining us. We have a big announcement when it comes to your retiree health benefits. We are excited to connect you with what's new for your retiree health benefits. The New Jersey SHBP and SEHBP, along with the Division of Pension and Benefits, are excited to welcome you to your new online benefits hub. In today's presentation, we will walk you through how to register on our new benefits website, show you which tools are available to help you access your retiree benefits, learn how to waive or enroll in your benefits, how to change your coverage, how to add or remove dependents, and how to upload supporting documents. Through the My NJ Benefits Hub, also known as Benefit Solver, you will have easy access to your retiree benefits, such as plan changes, benefit resources, and more. This online portal is being provided through our partnership with Business Solver, and it will make it easier than ever to access, understand, or change your benefits. You will have 24-7 access to My NJ Benefits Hub or through our new My Choice mobile app. Your retiree health benefit information will be accessible online. And starting January 1st, 2022, you will no longer use paper applications to make changes to your benefits. Instead, the enrollment process is moving online to My NJ Benefits Hub. You will be able to make a change to your coverage, add or remove dependents, and easily upload supporting documents. Business Solver is the COBRA administrator for all plans administered by SHBP slash SEHBP. So what's staying the same? Your retired plan options, including health, prescription, and dental are not changing. The way you are billed and pay for your benefits also will not change. If you have questions, you can contact the same New Jersey Division of Pension and Benefits Client Services Call Center. To get started, visit mynjbenefitshub.nj.gov and register your new secure account. Simply click the register button and then enter your social security number, date of birth, and the company key, SHBP slash SEHBP in all capital letters. You will create a username and password, which you will then use to log into the site. You can also log into the My NJ Benefits Hub through the My New Jersey portal. Just click the new button at the bottom labeled Benefit Solver, right next to the MBOS and EPIC button. If you do not have a Benefit Solver button, you must visit the NJDPB website to register. When you log in for the first time, you will be asked for your contact information. Enter your preferred email address to receive important information about your benefits. Once you're logged into the site, you'll find plenty of helpful information about your benefits. You can utilize the My Benefits tab to navigate health, prescription, and dental resources. The Reference Center has planned detail information. You can use the quick links for easy access. And if you wanna review your current coverage, click on the Benefits Summary button. If you have questions, you can chat with Sophia, your personal benefits assistant. If you prefer doing everything from a tablet or your smartphone, you can access your benefits information through the My Choice mobile app. This app allows you to store images of your insurance cards so you're never stuck at the doctor's office without them again. If you get married and need to add your new spouse to your plan, my Choice makes it easy to add your dependents and upload verification documents. You can check to see if your benefits cover an upcoming medical event, such as a surgery. And you can chat with Sophia anytime, day or night. Download the My Choice mobile app from the Google Play or App Store and then go to the homepage of My NJ Benefits Hub. Click on the Get Access Code button to get started. If the code is not used within 20 minutes, you can always come back and generate a new one. If you are a new retiree, you can enroll and manage your health benefits online at My NJ Benefits Hub. You can expect to receive a letter from Business Solver outlining important information about your retiree health benefits and coverage options. Your current coverage as an SHBP or SEHBP active employee will automatically transition to retiree group coverage. 
You will have 60 days to make any changes to your retiree coverage at My NJ Benefits Hub. When you're ready to enroll, click the Start Here button. The calendar will display how many days you have left to enroll. The next series of screens will walk you through the enrollment process step by step, showing you available benefit options. Be sure to use the Next and Previous buttons at the bottom of the screen to progress through the site, as your browser's arrows will not work with this site. Be sure to add your dependent demographic information. This will not add your dependents to coverage until you check them off on the coverage screen. Review your personal and dependent information and benefit elections to make sure they're all accurate, then click Looks Good. If you need to make changes, click Edit next to Medical or Dental. To see more details of the topic you selected, click Edit on a review page. This will help you make the changes you need. Don't forget to make one final review of your elections. This includes making sure that all dependents are listed. To complete your transaction, click Approve. And then I agree on the confirmation screen. Once your enrollment is complete, you will receive a confirmation number and can print your benefit summary. If you are a retiree already enrolled in state health benefits, you will be able to make changes through My NJ Benefits Hub, such as updating your demographic information, making a plan change, or processing a qualifying life event. Once you're on the home page, you'll want to navigate to the Change My Benefits buttons. One will be at the top of the page, and the other will be an icon in the center of the page. The icons may look different on pages other than the home page, so look for one that looks like a pencil and paper. Please review your information in Benefit Solver to make sure it is accurate. Then, if you need to update that information, click on the Change My Benefits button and select Life Event. Select the Address and Phone Information Change option from the drop-down menu to proceed to the following page to update your information. If you experience a qualifying life event and need to change your retiree benefits, click on the Change My Benefits button. Choose Life Event and then select the applicable option from the drop-down menu. Remember, once you make a plan change, you will not be able to make additional plan changes for another 12 months. If you add new dependents to your coverage, you will be prompted to provide supporting documentation. This will feel similar to the enrollment process. Once again, you'll want to make one final review of the changes to your benefits. This includes making sure that all dependents are listed. To complete your transaction, click Approve, and then I agree on the confirmation screen. Once your enrollment is complete, you will receive a confirmation number and can print your benefit summary. Let's take a look at how to upload documentation. If you add new dependents to your coverage, you will be prompted to provide supporting documentation. You'll want to look for the button that says Action Needed. This will be in the center of the screen when you first open the app and contains a picture of a briefcase. Once you've scanned your documents, click the Upload Documents button on your Actions Required list to easily upload them. You can also take a photo of your documents and upload them to the MyChoice mobile app. Just click the Action Needed image on the dashboard of your MyChoice mobile app to get started. You can find more information on the Change My Benefits page on My NJ Benefits Hub. The NJ DPB team will review all uploaded documents before the dependent is verified and approved for coverage. You can do the same thing directly on My NJ Benefits Hub. Look for the briefcase icon that says Action Needed. Walk through the prompts to upload a scanned document. PDFs and JPEG files are preferred. You can even add a message to your documents. Once you have completed your enrollment, don't forget to return to the home page and check for any additional tasks. There, you can download the MyChoice mobile app. You can visit the MyNJ Benefits Hub anytime to learn more about your benefits, 
or even search for a new provider and book an appointment using the My Choice Find a Provider, powered by Amino. If you have questions or need help at any time, chat with Sophia, your personal benefits assistant. She is located at the bottom right corner of every page of My NJ Benefits Hub, and she can answer many questions related to your benefits. If Sophia can't answer your question, you can always call the NJDPB Office of Client Services at 609-292-7524, Monday through Friday, 8 a.m. to 4 p.m., except state holidays. Thanks for watching and enjoy exploring My NJ Benefits Hub.